Well, Ridley Scott's Napoleon is finally out. And to be honest with you, it's a 50-50 for me. There isn't really much to spoil here, so I'm not going to call it a spoiler-free review. There's no twist at the end like The Sixth Sense. It's just one of those films that underwhelms, I'm afraid. The film has production value, it has terrific action sequences, but the film is shabbily written and the pacing is off, and there are superfluous scenes with Joaquin Phoenix that are just, I don't know what to say. The cast are excellent, Tahar Rahim, Joaquin Phoenix, Vanessa Kirby, they're all great in their roles, but there's just something wrong with the writing and the pacing of the film and the character development It just led me to not care about the characters whatsoever throughout the film, which is a weird thing actually. I enjoyed the action sequences, particularly the Russian one. It's really well staged and executed, and it's what you would expect from a Scott movie, but the film is just not the sum of its parts. Historical inaccuracies aside, the writing of this film is what lets it down. And it's really easy to wail on a film like this, a production of this size, and the skill of a director like Ridley Scott who pulls it all together. It's not great, it's not bad, I wouldn't go as far as to say it's good. It's worth a watch, but just temper your expectations going in. It is a Ridley Scott film, there is great spectacle involved, but it's more like a Robin Hood than a gladiator or a kingdom of heaven. Well, I hope that review was helpful. I wouldn't like to put you off the film. Go give it a watch, let me know what you thought in the comments, and I'll see you in the next review. If you enjoyed the review, please give a like and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts in the comments, and I'll see you in the next one.